9 to 5 Mac on YouTube is sponsored by Pixel Film Studios Final Cut Pro Social Mega Pack. The Final Cut Pro Social Mega Pack from Pixel Film Studios features a whopping 600 social media tools from over 18 different categories located across titles, generators, and transitions. It includes animated icons, emojis, follow screens, lower thirds, messages, video channel tools, tags, video creator tools, in screens, 3D icons, and more. For example, you can easily add a subscribe button or add a thumbs up button, a great way to remind your viewers to engage. And like all Pixel Film Studios plugins, it's highly customizable. So you can customize it to look just right on your channel with different colors and much, much more. And the great thing about Pixel Film Studios is that they always provide you with an abundance of options. So with that in mind, let's look back at the video channel tools and find another subscribe reminder. Just drop it on the timeline like that play it back, and there you go. Don't forget to like and subscribe. But like I was saying, that was just the tip of the iceberg. There are tons of emoji characters as well. You can simply drop an emoji right on the timeline, right above your footage, just like that. And again, highly customizable. All you need to do is go over to the inspector. There you can easily rotate, change the size and position, and so much more. And you can also do so with on-screen controls as well. So here's what it looks like. Pretty cool, huh? But again, there is much more to consider. Let's talk about one of my favorite aspects of the social mega pack, and that is the 3D phone feature. So you can create these highly customizable 3D phones and embed customized footage right there on the display, customize the status bar, scaling, three axis rotation, and so much more. And you can choose between different iPhone models as well. Just imagine yourself demoing your favorite footage right there on the iPhone's display in 3D space. So let's have a look up close and personal. And this, like I said, is just the tip of the iceberg as far as customization is concerned. But as you can see, the Pixel Film Studio Social Mega Pack makes it super easy. But what if you wanna display a text message conversation right there on your video? Well, I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. We're gonna actually build a conversation real quick. So I'm gonna put the first layer down we're just gonna simply add layers like this to build out our conversation. So this looks like a bona fide iMessage chat. So we're gonna go in here and actually customize the conversation, change each chat bubble one by one. So I'll just say something like, hey, have you checked out the new Pixel Film Studios social mega pack? How about that? Let's get that all typed in. Question mark. All right, so we'll customize all the other bubbles do check it out as fire. And now we'll just complete the conversation and it looks legit. So watch what happens when we play it back. You'll see the bubbles fade into view and automatically scroll up as the conversation continues. So it looks super natural and super realistic. So now we're just gonna create a compound clip. Just select all, give it a name and click okay. And now in the effects browser, we're gonna drag the compound messages tool on top of our conversation. This allows you to apply effects, customize the look, the scale, rotation, and move while keeping the natural flow of the conversation intact just like this. What do you guys think? Let me know down below in the comment section your thoughts. But this isn't all because you also have the ability to have tracked messages as well. So here's my iPad and I can have a tracked conversation. Right now I just have the little now typing indicator, but I can have a full tracked conversation there as well. Now let's talk about in screens because I use in screens for my YouTube videos. I'm sure plenty of you guys do as well. Pixel Film Studios makes it super easy to do so via the social mega pack. I'm gonna show you how to build an in screen. So we're gonna go in here. I already dragged one of the in screens down to the top timeline. I'm going to go in and disable all the social media controls because I'm not going to use that in this example. So those are all disabled. So now what I'm going to do is enable the drop zone and select some footage for the first watch more box. So here's some good looking footage here from one of our previous Final Cut Pro Pixel Film Studios videos. So that looks good. You can go in and adjust all the parameters as well. We'll go ahead and also add another watch more video and our subscribe button and customize the text. Now, at the end of this video, I'm gonna show you what it looks like on our end screen, so stay tuned. But get this, Pixel Film Studios also has tons of Final Cut Pro tutorials on their YouTube channel. So if you wanna learn all the ins and outs about Final Cut Pro 10, 
like how to share a project, for instance, something simple like that, or even more advanced things, this is a great resource, ladies and gentlemen. Folks, you can get the Final Cut Pro Social Mega Pack right now for 30% off by using code 9to5pixel at checkout. Special thanks to Pixel Film Studios for sponsoring 9to5Mac.